Hi girls, today we are going to discuss about medical termination of pregnancy. In that we are going to discuss introduction, definition, indications, complications and methods of MTP. Let's see introduction. Medical termination of pregnancy is refers as the induction of abortion. The induction of abortion may be legal and illegal, safe and unsafe. There are many countries in the globe where the abortion is not at legalized in India. The abortion was legalized Medical Termination of Pregnancy Act 1971. In 1971 it has been legalized in India and came into force in April 1972. Definition Termination of pregnancy either by the medical and surgical method before the viability of the fetus is called Induction of abortion. Legal abortions. Termination is performed by the so legal abortion. So what are all the norms which has been legalized in act? So that we are going to discuss here. Termination should be performed by the medical practitioner who has assisted at least 25 medical termination of pregnancy and has degree in ops and gynecology. And termination is done at the, uh, at the place approved under the act. That means what has been written in the act that is in government hospital they can perform MTP and in private hospitals also this MTP can be performed but the private hospital should have license, medical termination of pregnancy license, MTP license that will be given by a medical officer of district hospitals then termination done for condition within the gestational week prescribed by the act the abortion has to be reported to the directorate of director of health services of the state what mtp how many mtps has been done that should be reported at director or director of health services of the states indications so when to whom it can be performed what are all the conditions so in which situation these abortions can be done legally women whose physical and mental health were endangered by the pregnancy suppose a woman who has pregnancy due to that pregnancy if she is going to get any mental or physical problem so that kind of pregnancy should be terminated and women facing the birth of potentially handicapped or malformed child so at the fifth month the pregnant woman go for tifa scan in that they will show it will be showing that is there any malformations or not suppose if there is any malformations are found in the ultrasonography then immediately they can go for mtp and rape a girl who has been raped and pregnancy came due to the rape so that also uh, can be terminated under this act and pregnancies in unmarried girls under the age of 18 years a pregnant a girl who has been become pregnant under the 18 years of age and who is unmarried that uh, pregnancy also should be terminated but there should be a consent of guardian and pregnancies that are a result of failure in sterilization so, if they had some temporary family planning due to that, if, if any failure in that sterilization, then they can go for this MT. So, these are the indications. So, termination is permitted up to 20 weeks of pregnancy. When pregnancy less than 12 weeks, two medical practitioners' opinion is required. The abortion has to be performed confidentially and reported to the as I said, the director of health services in prescribed form. Remember, the consent is very important. Without consent, we should not take, we should not go for MTP. It can be done only, it can be terminated on a written informed consent of the woman. And remember that husband consent is not required. And below 18 years are lunatic for them. A written consent should be taken from the parents or legal guardian. Place, as I said, that place where MTP is performed, that, that in government hospitals or non-governmental institutions also, but it should be 
uh, it should obtain license from chief medical officer of the district and methods of mtp medical termination of pregnancy so what in first first trimester in 3 months before 3 months during pregnancy first trimester medical method surgical first medical methods should be uh, performed maybe pristone mesoprostol should be given then abortion process started or completed then um, uh, uh, need not to go for surgical method so after giving medical method uh, medical method if abortion or termination did not occur then we can go for surgical method that is menstrual regulation dilatation and suction evacuation this will be discussing in later sessions so that will be done in first trimester in second trimester again medical and surgical mesoprostol method or other prostaglandins extra amniotic ethacridine lactate method intra amniotic hypotonic saline method high dose oxide oxytocin method so after failure of this medical method after giving then if it is not done then can go for surgical method that is hysterotomy opening of the uterus so that are all the methods of uh, medical termination of pregnancy ne complications of pregnancy immediate and remote so after immediate uh, medical termination of pregnancy if if any complications occurs just after the uh, process then that all comes under immediate so like injury to the cervix so possible injury to the cervix any cervical lacerations uterine perforation perforation due to the d and e dilatation and evacuation surgery or hemorrhage and shock due to the trauma sometimes incomplete abortion or tonic uterus or rarely we can see coagulation failure and thrombosis or embolism these kind of immediate complications occur remote or late so this it shows later after few days or few weeks or few months so gynecological and obstetrical complication we can see that is gynecological include menstrual disturbances who has uh, once abortion has been occur once so the the lots of 80% of people they will be having menstrual disturbances and chronic pelvic inflammation scar endometriosis this is only 1% there is a chance and obstetrical complications like ectopic pregnancy preterm labor dysmaturity rupture of uterus so these are the complications of mtp so medical termination of pregnancy this is a termination of pregnancy either by the medical and surgical method before the viability of the fetus is called induction of abortion or medical termination of pregnancy if you have any kinds of doubts please ask me thank you